take a moment to appreciate how long my hair is getting. Prenatals, number one, and um, mane and tail shampoo. I mean, I know it's not long, but it's long for me. You guys remember how my hair was, like even in the summer. Heck yeah. I'm gonna have my morning orange juice. My English muffin just popped up. Coffee, banana, peanut butter. Usually I have a grapefruit, but I don't feel like getting my face all <laughs> with the juice everywhere, so I'm gonna have my breakfast. I'm running super late, so I'm just gonna show you really quick what I have for lunch. <laughs> my water bottle. I have three egg whites and an egg, a whole six ounce, I guess, chicken breast with avocado, fruit, and a cliff bar. Guys, it happened. I am officially sick. Um, I had an eventful day yesterday um, at work. You guys saw me last just when I was making my lunch. Um, so long story short, I don't know how it happened, but um, on Wednesday, we had our NCO luncheon, so all the sergeants made us lunch. That night, my mom was up throwing up, my one coworker was throwing up, um, and then yesterday, um, my one coworker came into work and she still wasn't feeling well, so she left early, and then I started to feel like crap, and my other coworker started to feel like crap, um, and also that combined with the weather was so bad, like it was white out conditions like the poor officers were like run off their feet with like vehicle after vehicle after vehicle in the ditch someone needing an ambulance someone needing this and this and this it was crazy so we did go home early and um but that was just it took a while to get home just because the weather was so bad i'll make sure i'm still recording thank god um my camera's been acting up but anyways so um Colin came to pick me up and then he stayed home. We got home at like 1. I was eating, even though I felt crappy, I wasn't crappy in my stomach. Like I just feel like it, like just yucky. And I am fighting a cold because I still like have like green coming out of my nose. I know that's disgusting and I apologize, but I guess I just have a cold. Um, so we got a pizza and then Colin bought me my favorite candy or chocolate in the whole world, which is our Milk Duds. So I had a bunch of milk duds, and then I shared some salt and vinegar chips with him, and like my diet has been shit. Like I said, the past week, it's just been really, really bad, and it's just been really bad. Um, so I think that has a lot to do with me feeling so sick, it's just because I've been eating crappy. And Christmas, it, today's Friday, I took the day off because... I just felt horrible this morning. I feel a bit better now. It's like 20 to 11, but I'm still like stuffy in my body. Just I feel weak and like achy and just like bleh. So um, I had an English muffin this morning with peanut butter and jam and just one. And I'm kind of hungry again. So uh, today I'm just focusing on like salads, whole foods, like natural foods. So I'm going to make myself an omelet because that sounds really good to me right now. Primarily an egg white omelet um, with some tomato and stuff because I feel like I just feel bloated because I've been eating really bad and I just want to and I'm pregnant so that obviously bloats you but um, I just want to eat better and feel better so um, I'm gonna do that I did take my iron this morning my probiotic and my excuse me B12 um, and I've been eating a lot of um, grapefruit which sorry I'm stuffy it's awful, um, which is a lot of vitamin C, and I've been having orange juice. I just feel like poo, <laughs> but I'm going to make myself an omelet, and I'll show you what that looks like. So I've just got one whole egg and three whites in there with my onion, and then I've got salt, pink Himalayan salt, garlic powder, um, and cayenne pepper, and then I'm going to put one of these guacamole things on top for some healthy fat and season it with pepper. And that'll be it. That is the finished, excuse me, product. So I'm actually feeling a lot better. I think because I just took it easy this morning. Um, yeah, I just feel a lot better. Um, so I was waiting on a MAC order. I just got a concealer and a powder because I needed, I ran out. Something on my nail there. Oh, I just broke it. Lovely. Um, anyways. So yeah, it said it was um, 
delivered like 10 minutes ago and I'm like no it wasn't I open my door there's nothing there and we have a front door and a side door but we always use our side door and it has a big number our house number that's like this big if not bigger it's like six inches and it's black I don't know how they miss it it's always FedEx and this DHL company and they always send they drop stuff off at my neighbor's house because they have a number on theirs that's our number but with an A beside it but I'm like if you clearly see ours is this number and theirs is this number and an A so I'm just like how do you mess that up but it's so frustrating because I always have to go over and be like where's my package you guys have my package and most of the time it's just sitting at their door so I just take it um, and then go but it's just annoying so anyways I am feeling better thank God but so now I'm really frustrated because um, I also ordered a um, mineralized skin finish natural and light and I get the receipt and it says it's been back ordered but at the time of order they had it in stock so I'm like are you kidding me I don't know it's just annoying but I got a pro long wear concealer because I've tried a thousand different concealers I do like the NARS one but the NARS one's too dark for me so I have to use that for blemishes and stuff but I got it in NC 15 because it's nice and light and brightening and honestly it's the best concealer on the market in my opinion and then I just got a little sample that was free of the MAC Prep and Prime. But that sucks about the skin finish, but whatever. I also forgot I have to book my ultrasound. Um, why is that doing that? I don't know. I have to book my ultrasound um, for when I'm 19 to 20 weeks because then we can determine, find out the sex of the baby. So I need to book that at the local hospital. And I'm just getting stuff done. I'm folding laundry. I'm putting stuff away. Feel good. Dishes are, hold on, let me focus. Ooh, done. Kitchen is clean. Everything is wiped down and tidy. The fridge, the microwave, the cabinets. Because a lot of people don't think to wipe down their cabinets, but they get like sticky hands fingerprints and stuff like that so I use a vinegar water mixture and wipe it all down so it kills bacteria and it cleans I vacuum to wash the floors I'm gonna wrap my sister-in-law's gift I still have to well I'm kind of tired now but I was going to iron my tablecloth but I don't know if that's happening I did dishes ignore that pan that has to go back to my neighbor um, I have laundry hanging randomly up here but it's all done and clean this has been vacuumed and washed um, everything's picked up in here it's all clean and the bathroom is all clean I put fresh towels I'm just waiting on the bath mat to be done in the wash all fresh and clean so yeah I love having a clean house I just went like a mad woman and like I don't know where this energy came from but apparently I'm feeling better so I'm gonna go. So I just made myself, it's 2.30, and now I'm having my lunch. <laughs> um, so I just have a salad, the same thing I always have. I did have a grapefruit, which you guys didn't see, but that omelet kept me full for a while. And I have had, um, I think four, I don't know if I showed this, but um, drinking water makes a huge difference in your hunger levels because I think I've had four of those. I believe they're about Oh, they're more than eight out. I think it's like a nine or ten ounce cup. And I've had four of them, so I wasn't as hungry. So that's like a tip. Drink loads of water. You won't be as hungry. So, um, but now I'm hungry. I had my grapefruit. Now I'm going to have my salad. And I am boiling some eggs because I love hard-boiled eggs. Just to have as a snack, like two of them or whatever. Super, super healthy. It's just good to have on hand. So I'm doing that as well. And then I'm making... Um, bacon wrapped turkey burgers healthy ones for supper um and i'll probably make some fries for colin but um yeah so that's sawing and yeah i'm gonna eat this bad boy my burgers are finished and i just put them um in the pan for a bit to sear them and then in the oven so yeah i'm gonna have one and yeah they look delicious